What is up everybody? We are back again. And here we have the engine. Last time you saw this in the re uh, reveal video, she was had all this junk on it. But all that junk has been removed. And now we got bare block with the bottom end still in it. Probably not gonna mess around with the bottom end a whole lot. Boards look good. Everything's shiny and dandy, clean everything up. But other than that, ready to rock and roll. What we'll be doing today, pulling off this uh, front cover, hopefully, and uh, getting the getting the cam swapped. Um, I haven't ordered the cam yet, so um, but that's all right. I'll just just make the rest of this video later. So for now, I got this uh, front camshaft pulley bolt out. That was awful. It's a nightmare. Um, but got it. Sucked a little bit. No big deal. So now I'm going to use the uh, gear puller. Hopefully pull this freaking chunk of a pulley off and then throw that away and we'll go from there. But the cam I'm going to order is a Brian Tooley Twin Turbo Stage 3. So hopefully that uh, gets a few people excited. If not, you know, that's all right too. All right, it took some freaking work. But we got the crank pulley off um, using some redneck methods. Two, a, two, a two lever gear puller, which you should not use for this. And Old Faithful in Milwaukee here. If it wasn't for that guy, that would've been impossible. So, crank pulley's off. Time to take off the cover. kind of dark hard to see but there's our camshaft gear our oil pump right here and then the end of the crank we'll go ahead and uh, pull these bolts off well what I'm gonna do first make sure the uh, crank get that dot aligned and then get this dot here and then pull off this gear. Hopefully everything goes smooth. Got the cam sprocket off. Started to undo the oil pump. Um, I think I'm going to pull the oil pan and flip it over. Um, because the lifters are still in there right now. So to keep the lifters from spinning or from falling in when I pull the cam. So I pull the oil pan, pull the cam plate, uh, flip her over, pull the cam. Mess with the oil pump. Not in that order, something like that. There you have it. The camshaft is out. Sitting over there currently. I used the old uh, water pump bolt trick. Works great. Once you get the bolts in there, spin the camera a couple times, it'll throw the lifters back. In my case, the engine was upside down, so I didn't need to worry about lifters falling in. Uh, you can't see these lobes too good, but I checked them all over. Everything looks good. This engine only had 140,000. It's not, not nothing, but it's not something. So it's 
somewhere in the middle. Anywho, I believe that's about it. Pulled the pan off. It's a little dirty, not dirty, but you know, used under here, but doesn't look all that bad. So probably get the new cam on the way, new oil pan on the way. And so that's probably it for now. See you in a couple days. Here we go. Got the package from Brian Tooley. Let's open it up. So here she is, Brian Tooley Racing, camshaft, comp cams, pretty sweet, pretty dope. Got the little spec sheet up here, returning the junk, probably not need that. Got the instruction book, pretty handy, most important part, two stickers. Here's the beauty herself. I won't take it out of the bag until it's actually time to install it, but I think it's it. Looks pretty good. All right, got the engine uncovered. There's the old cam slot right there. Go ahead and get that cam thrown in. Got the uh, high performance assembly lube. Got the cam, got the gloves, ready to go. All right, so that's pretty much gonna do it for this one. You see that fresh new cam down in there? Looking good. Excited about it. Got the retainer plate on, but not uh, not torqued or anything, just got the bolts on. But this dude turns freely. I'm excited about it. Gonna make some power. So if you're interested, feel free to check back on the build. I'm sure you guys, it's easy to find a video on how to Reassemble this bad boy right here. The uh, timing chain, all that stuff, but basically you put the gear back on here. Align the dot up here with the dot on this guy, which is, uh, don't know where it is right now. Probably on the bottom, but line the dots up. Slide the chain on, easy peasy, but if you're interested in the build, feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one.